Hey guys, this is CG Animator, and today I'm going to show you how to set up a quick uh, green screen layout within uh, Blender. And uh, I would use 2.5 for this, but uh, all of the beta versions of Blender right now, of 2.5, have been giving me uh, big trouble, uh, at least on my computer for some reason. Maybe it's my drivers or something. I don't know. I'm going to get it checked out. But uh, it just Blender crashes every like five minutes. But luckily, we still have good old. 2.49 here so we can just use this and anything you see here can be transferred over to 2.5 so let's just get started so first we need something uh, to green screen so let's go ahead and make something let's go ahead and erase our cube so we have something a little more dynamic uh, than a cube let's make a UV sphere and just set it smooth maybe add a subsurf modifier Oops. okay let's go ahead and uh, Put the camera right here. Press Control Alt Zero on the numpad to get it right there, like that. Let's press Alt Z to go into shaded view here. Let's go ahead and uh, set up just some basic lights. Just put two lights there and there. Okay. Let's go and select the sphere and just give it a better material here. Let's go ahead and turn the specularity down. That's all we need to do. Maybe make it a little a little darker. Maybe just a little bit. All right. So now here's the important part. We need to go over to the World tab. I'll turn off blend if you have it on and we need to go to our main uh, color here and we need to turn the green level all the way up so that we have a green screen alright so let's uh, press F12 okay here we have our green screen press F3 let's go ahead and save it I think I already saved something called green screen earlier uh, as green screen yeah so let's just save the JPEG yeah save over okay so now that we have that let's go into the node editor and uh, do a little compositing Let's go into the composite nodes. Uh, press use nodes. I always like to set up a, a viewer node. That's one of the first things I always do. So let's go ahead and set up an image that we can put uh, our green screen on. Uh, so press shift A or space since we're in 2.49. Add input image. And uh, I'm just going to load it, uh, a still that I made a, a while ago. Uh, with ZBrush and Blender. Here we go. And it's just uh, just something I made for fun that we can use here. Okay, I guess I could show you guys what it looks like. Here it is. It's just like an alien holding a flame or something. But it's, uh, it's pretty cool, I guess. I like it. But we'll just uh, do this. So now we can just go to our render layer here. Press Shift A. Uh, let's see where it is. Matte chroma key. And this is what we're going to be using. We're going to uh, chroma key this. So let's go ahead and uh, set this, uh, the render layer to the chroma key and the chroma key to the viewer node. And let's select the key color sample green so that it takes away, it takes out all the green from the, from the image. So now that we have that, uh, everything gets really simple. We just select uh, anything. Press space, color, alpha over and you want the, the picture that you want in the background to be on top so we're gonna make the chroma key here at the bottom image alright so here we have something but it's not very it doesn't look good so I think uh, if we just turn down the acceptance yeah that does it but we get this like white line here and there's two ways to fix that pretty good convert does a little bit of it and if we turn down the gain value it also does it and that's it. So if we just uh, put the alpha over uh, node over to the composite node, press F12. Of course, we have to enable do composite here. Okay, yeah, and uh, here we have it. Pretty simple. Uh, all right, guys. So that's how you basically how you uh, green screen in Blender. I hope you found this uh, tutorial useful. And uh, be sure to watch some more tutorials in the future. Alright guys, thanks. Bye.